In this problem, we're looking for the diameter of a ball as it is rolled across a level floor. Now the important thing to realize is that the distance along the floor that the ball travels through is going to be some multiple of the ball's circumference. And the circumference of a circle or a ball is equal to 2 pi times the radius of the ball. Uh, we're actually not given the ball's radius, but we're looking for its diameter. So another way to write this is pi times the diameter of the ball. This, this is another alternative formula for the ball's circumference, since the diameter is equal to twice the radius. And this is also what we want to find. So just to recap, the distance that the ball travels, which is given to us, is going to be equal to the number of revolutions times the circumference of the ball. Since the ball's circumference is how far the ball travels through one revolution. So this can be thought of as like a, a chain link conversion type thing, where the, uh, the revolutions cancel out and we're just left with an answer in meters. Though remember, this d here is what we actually want to solve for. So let's algebraically rewrite this to solve for d. So it's going to be 3.5 meters of travel distance divided by 12 revolutions times pi. If we put that into our calculator, we find a distance of about 9.3 times 10 to the power of negative 2 meters. So that is the diameter of the ball. That's all for this problem. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please consider subscribing as that'll help me out in making more videos like this. If you have a question, leave a comment down below and I'll do my best to help you out. If you have a request for a future video or you would just like to hang out, my Discord server and my Twitch page are both linked in the description below, so check those out if you'd like. But that's all for now, and I hope you all have a lovely night. Bye-bye.